According to legend, the Giant's Causeway in Northern Ireland dates back to the time of Fionn Mac Cool, a giant tasked with defending his land from the fearsome Ben and Donner. The story goes that Fionn decided to take the challenge head on, and built this causeway as a way to approach his foe, although the story goes off in many directions from there. Whatever its origins, the sight of some 40,000 basalt columns jutting out into the North Atlantic Ocean is one of the most unique images around, backed by imposing hills and the quietly seething sea. It's easy to convince yourself that the swirling colors of China's Zhang Yadansha Mountains are actually a painting, but this gorgeous landscape is very, very real. The colors are thanks to the whimsical movements of mineral deposits over millennia, although it took just about that much time for China to pay much attention to it. Several observation decks offer visitors stunning views without damaging the landscape, which is good news for everyone. If aliens exist on Earth, they exist here. The Danukal Depression in Ethiopia is a weirder than weird piece of wonder that is the result of three tectonic plates diverging and leaving behind lava lakes, acidic springs and more. It is known as the hottest place on the planet, and that is no joke. Geothermal activity in summer causes temperates to reach as high as 55 degrees Celsius. Hidden away in British Columbia, Canada's Spotted Lake, known to First Nations people as Kliluk is straight out of science fiction. This small body of water is packed with different minerals, from masses of calcium and sodium sulfates to small amounts of silver and titanium. When the water evaporates in summer, a weird collection of deposits is left behind, giving the spotted lake its moniker. You can actually walk around the deposits in summer, although good luck shaking the feeling that something might jump out at any moment. Australia's Jervis Bay is actually home to the whitest sandy beach on the planet, but visitors don't flock here for whiter than white sand. Okay, some do, but most head to this 102 square kilometer oceanic bay for the magic that comes after dark. Jervis Bay is one of the few places on the planet where people can see the wonder of bioluminescence, as masses of plankton glow in the dark and give the water a gorgeously ethereal look. These are noctiluca, or maybe the more apt sea sparkle, and the light is a chemical reaction causing excitement and vibration, generating the glow in the process. Bioluminescence is most often seen in the warmer months, but you can get lucky at all times of the year in Jervis Bay, 